Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are exploring how to build a fully automated workflow using Microsoft Visual and Power Automate. If you are still handling requests manually, it's time to streamline and upgrade your process. I will show how to export Visual diagrams directly into Power Automate to bring your business workflows to life automatically. Today I will cover mapping triggers and action for automation and exporting workflow to Power Automate. If you are a business analyst or business user, you don't need a developer to build this. Let's get started. I already have defined a procurement process based on requirement document in Excel. If you see, we have Excel table and I have integrated this Excel table to Visio. If you don't know how to integrate Excel with Visio, Please check out my earlier videos where I walk through how to integrate Excel with Visio. While integrating Excel with Visio, make sure that you use basic BPM flowchart. Again, labels are defined to each process. And once the diagram is ready, just go to the process tab and click on the export. If you want to see flow markup, then just click on show markup and click on export. It will open a new panel on the right hand side where we have to map our triggers, conditions, and as well as we have to resolve issues. As soon as you click on export, Visio automatically detects all shapes and it maps accordingly with triggers and actions. You just have to go on the right hand side panel and you can see we have only one trigger in our diagram that is purchase request created. Let's go to, yeah. Again, we have to map conditions. We have two conditions. It has detected two conditions. Just map them as condition with S. And again, except goes with condition S. And let's see if we have issues. As I haven't mapped any shape with trigger and action, so it will definitely show issue. Let's map them. For purchase request, we'll add a trigger like when item is created in SharePoint, it is SharePoint and item created. Just click on it. It will automatically map it with your shape. Next, go to the start approval process. For start approval process, I will I do have action, fetch action. Which item from SharePoint. Okay, get items. Then we have gateway, which we already have mapped. Like this, I have mapped all shapes in another diagram. We'll open that diagram. And just refresh the diagram and click on export. While exporting, you can provide the name to workflow. Procurement workflow test, okay. From zero. And we just have to grant necessary permissions for our flow in Power Automate and click on create. And it will generate a flow directly into Power Automate. Let's go to Power Automate. If you see, I already have opened my Power Automate. Just refresh it. You will see all the flows are added to My Flows. Go to My Flows and, and click on your workflow. has already created a workflow and in next video we'll see how to edit and pass the parameters to our workflow that's how you can export your video diagram to power automate and if you found this video helpful give it a thumb subscribe for more videos and drop a comment with your thoughts thanks for watching stay tuned for more videos thank you